my name is Simon. I'm one of the instructors at Aret Outdoor Centre and I'm going to give you a little activity here for contours. So, um, maps are a bird's eye, two dimensional uh, picture of the world which actually exists in 3D. And from here we can see the hills in Snowdonia kind of rise up. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a little exercise which shows how we can make these contours come alive. So for this, you're going to need a pair of scissors, a sharpie or some sort of marker pen. You're going to need a sheet, a blank sheet of white paper, and you're going to need some cardboard. So to start with, we're going to want to make uh, a 3D model. So we're going to do that using a piece of cardboard. So first of all, I'm going to draw a shape, so let's just draw a shape like this, and then I'm going to cut it out. And once I've got my shape, I'm going to repeat. This time I'm going to make it slightly bigger. So I'm going to draw around it slightly bigger, leave a bit of a margin, and then I'm going to cut that out. Okay? And you need to repeat this about five or six times. So here's one I made earlier. So I'll put that away. And on the floor you can see one I've already made. So this one's got several pieces and it all sits together to kind of make uh, an image of the hill. What I'm then going to do is I'm going to take my piece of paper and I'm going to draw on this in reverse. So I'm going to take my biggest size first. I'm going to draw around it. And then I'm going to get the next size down. Pop that on. That one. Next one. And then the last one. So you can see here, we very quickly managed to create a 3D model and we've turned it into 2D, so two dimensions, uh, and that's what we call contours. Here's another illustration, so 3D, that's flat, I'm just going to draw around my knuckles. You can see that that's 3D. And when I flatten my hand, you can see the contour in two dimensions. So, nice little easy exercise for you to have a go at. Let us show us how you get on. Thanks.